Hello everyone, I am Dr. Ankit Madharia. I am an orthopedic surgeon and today I will be demonstrating a procedure of transforaminal endoscopic dissecting. As you can see here, we have an MRI picture of a 55 year old female patient who had complaints of left lower limb radicular pain since 9 months. MRI shows left sided disc at L4 L5 level which is compressing on the traversing nerve root. An endoscopic portal was created at the level of L4 L5 on the left side. Inside out technique was followed and intradiscal decompression was started. An endoscopic articulated hook was used to tease out the degenerated nucleus into the working channel. The degenerated nuclear tissue was extracted by using a grasper. After achieving intradiscal decompression, the cannula was withdrawn to show half in half out view where you can see the bipolar probe working on the outer edge of the annular fibers. Further subannular decompression was achieved by using the graspers anterior to the annular fibers. The fat tissue can be seen coming in and out through the epidural space. The fibers of the edge of the annulus were cut by using annulotome. This was done to access the central and paracentral portion of the disc. Here you can see the epidural vein come in the center of our view which will be coagulated now with our radio frequency bipolar probe. The bony structure you will see now is the superior articular process of L5 vertebra. After finishing the annulotomy, we can see a central disc fragment which is trapped in the annular fibers which cannot be mobilized easily. The nuclear trapped fragment is removed by using grasper a flexible grasper is finally used to remove the central and paracentral part of the disc. Discectomy is thus completed. This procedure was done completely under local anesthesia in an alert and conscious patient. Patient was allowed to walk after 3 hours of the procedure and has got complete relief from her leg pain.